Hi, my name is Ivo. I'm doing research into Nikola Tesla's impulse electricity and I can create impulses by using coil discharges, inductive spikes. Until now I used MOSFETs uh, that could handle around 900 volt impulses, a little bit higher, but I thought it isn't enough. So I found a method to make higher voltage impulses. And that met method is switching MOSFETs in series. I did a little vid video on it uh, just before this one. And right now I am testing it. I'll show you right now, that's easier. For this test, I used the radiant power circuit of 2019 that I published before, except without the DC offset because that's totally dangerous and very unnecessary for this to work. And uh, I didn't fine tune anything. I didn't use the L3 coil. I just used a L1 coil that is pulsed by the MOSFETs uh, to create the impulses. And I used a series resonant L2 coil to pass the impulse to ground and measure it. I'm testing with series switched MOSFETs. I have here a half bridge PCB but I'm using it differently. I'm using the two MOSFETs to switch in series. So the signals that are coming in are in phase. They're exactly the same signals. Each MOSFET has its own gate driver IC and its own uh, isolated DC to DC uh, power driver, which gives this MOSFETs uh, 20 volts positive and minus volt negative to switch the gate. The MOSFETs right now are the C2M008200D. These are capable of at least 1200 volts, but uh, in testing I've seen they can handle 1500 volts. What I've done is add three series diodes and each diode can block a thousand volt impulses. I'll turn on the signal generator and I'll turn off the fan and the system. I've got everything on right now. I'll switch the power on and I'll show you the scope shot now. Right now the signal is 500 volts per division. So we've got one, two, three and a little bit more so around 1700 volt impulses and I'm putting in 22 volts. I'll put up the power now and I'll drive it up. Okay, I'm now at 30.1 kilocycles per second and the impulses right now are, let's put it on the one, two, three, four, five, Six, so we have already almost 3000 kilovolts impulses with an input of 22.2 volts and 0 0.94 amperes. So it is working. Yes, great. I'll zoom in so we can see the duration of the impulse that is around 500 nanoseconds. Yeah, beautiful. Let's give it a little bit more because the MOSFETs can take it a little bit of a beating. Oh my god, this is the top. So I can give it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven times 500 volts is three and a half thousand volt impulses. Okay, I'm gonna switch it off. This was at twice 13.6 volts and 1.2 amps. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> I'm very happy that this is possible because these are only 1200 volt MOSFETs and I have the 1700 volt uh, MOSFETs. Very excited about this. The next step is uh, making a half bridge out of this. So that means uh, two times two MOSFETs in series, each with their own 
isolated gate driver and this way I can create very high voltage positive and negative impulses. I need to do more testing and uh, when that works of course I will give you an update again. So thank you for watching and see you later.